Okay, okay, okay. What's going on, everybody? Lockout man here. What's up, what's up? I am here in the truck. I am here for you. Yo, welcome, welcome. Today's topic, we're we going to talk about cell phone plans. We're going we gonna to talk about that. We're about, we about to talk about the different cell phone plans in here because a lot of a lot of the times a lot of the drivers that's that comes out here over the road and they ask they ask this question. I, I, I even I even get this question. I, I get this question a lot. Yo, what what, what kind of what, what what's the best cell phone plans and coverage out here? I don't I don't know. I don't know. Let's get into it. What's going on everybody? With the with the retro background, y'all see that on the thirty, that is what's up, man. I, lo- I I'm I'm liking the fact that with this green screen, I could I could change whatever I want. But thank you for joining me. And if you guys like content like this and more, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, and hit that bell on the way out or way in, and make sure you hit that all button. Today's topic we're going to get into is cell phone plans, man. We're going to we're going to talk about that. It's not too many people out here that's that's talking about cell phone plans. And and now that it's the new millennial, the new the new 2020, you know what it is? A lot of drivers out here now rely on data. You know what I'm saying? It's not just the cell phone anymore. We rely on data. We use data for a lot. We use it for our apps. We use it for our video calls. We use it for our upload, our download, and all that other good stuff. So basically, if you're a YouTube creator like myself, you're looking for a good plan that has fast data that has fast unlimited data now back in the day i was with verizon and as a matter of fact verizon is who we're going to talk about first that's when verizon brought back a quote unquote unlimited package plan let's talk about it now with this if you're a single if if you're a single if you're a single driver and you just want uh want one line for yourself this is this is the plan that you're going to end up uh going with um it's an unlimited start plan it is for like seventy dollars it gives you basic data uh basic unlimited talk text and data i'm not sure how much uh how much unlimited i think it's like a little bit and then you get throttled if you go over a certain amount but it's still unlimited but your your connection is slow so let's say you watching netflix and everything flowing you're streaming movies playing good and then all of a sudden on the action part it started getting choppy that's that that's that throttle right there still unlimited but that's the throttle they saying yeah you can still watch this movie but you're going to watch this movie at a tro- uh, at a choppy rate uh, they got another one here called Play More Unlimited, which is eighty dollars. Do More Unlimited, which probably gives you a little bit more data for eighty dollars, and Get More Unlimited, which is ninety dollars. I cannot, I can't connect on that to to see what the background is. Now, as far as now, as far as Verizon goes, as far as Verizon goes, my opinion with Verizon, they do have the best service and what i mean by the best service you you pretty much will not get dropped out nowhere you you could probably pick up a you if you got a verizon phone and you in the boondocks there's a good chance that you might have maybe about one or two bars of service to at least make a phone call now as far as as far as the internet or the data goes out there i'm not sure about that but if you're if you're in the boondocks and and you really need to make that emergency phone call without without it being dropped, there's a slight chance that you might be able to get that service with uh, with Verizon. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Next up, next up, we're gonna talk about we we we're gonna talk about the company that I am with. And again, like I said, it's personal preference. I when I went over to T-Mobile, believe me, I did my homework. I said, "Look, I wanted uh I want unlimited data, 
with no throttle and no cap. At that time, I couldn't find it. AT&T wasn't offering it. You know, you had to do a, in order for you to get it on AT&T, you had to get a business plan. And that was like in the upwards of like four, five, six hundred dollars a month. And I couldn't, I couldn't afford that. I called Sprint. Same thing with Sprint. I had to get a, I had to get like a business plan, and it was like in the upwards of a full. Again, with them, that was in the upwards of full five hundred dollars with them too, and I couldn't afford it. So, my last option was going with T-Mobile. Now they got a different, they got a different plan now from when I actually started. So when I got with when I got with T-Mobile, I said, "Look, this is what I want, and this is what I need." I said, "I need a phone." And I need a I need data that's like literally unlimited at 4G, and a, you know a, no no cap. Now at the time they offered it to me, they was like, yeah, we got that, we got that, we got unlimited data, no cap. Um, your phone, you know, text, talk, talk, talking text, and all like that. But they said, yo, for an extra twenty five dollars, you can uh. You can continue to get 4G speeds even when you tether your phone to a laptop or tether your phone to any other device. I was like, word? I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. You mean if I pay you an extra $25 and that's it, an extra $25 a month, I will continue to get 4G speeds with no throttle, no cap, and I could tether to any computer or tablet or any other phone I want. She was like, "Yeah, well, T-Mobile. I, you know, I'm I'm pretty good with T-Mobile. Now with one line with T-Mobile, you get the essentials for sixty dollars. You get unlimited talking texts, unlimited four G, four G, four G LTE data speeds, which is it, it is throttled after a while. Um, you get the hotspot, unlimited three uh, G data." You get T-Mobile Tuesdays. You get the dedicated customer service care. Now, let me, the customer service is on point. I never had a problem or never had an issue with their customer service. They always took care of me when I have a problem. I will call them up and say, hey, my phone's acting up or whatever, whatever. And they will take care of me right then, right then and there. I never had no problems with that. They got other benefits. They got international testing international uh, unlimited talk talk text and data in mexico and canada but it's only at 2g speeds though so you gotta watch that it's at 2g speeds uh unlimited video at sd streaming live nations vip perks uh let's see now right here you can get an extra 10 gigabytes of 4g lte mobile hotspot you know, for ten for an extra ten dollars, HD streaming for an extra three, voicemail to text for an extra four, ID ID on call blocker an extra four, uh, tablet extra fifteen, and wearable an extra ten. Uh, the next one is the Magenta, which is seventy dollars, and you get the you get everything. You get everything, but taxes included over here, and you get a bump up in your data. Um, you get three G, three gigabytes of four G uh, four G LT, LTE data, and then it's, it drops down to unlimited three uh, G. So you basically get uh, basically getting an extra uh, international data. You at two G speeds. Make sure you watch that. Unlimited talk texts in Mexico and Canada. Five gigs of four G, and then it goes down to unlimited uh, two gigs. Uh, in-flight testing and Wi-Fi, you get unlimited testing for an hour on Wi-Fi. Uh, same perks, same perks, same perks. And right here, Magenta Plus, you get everything that's in the Magenta. You don't get no more Netflix. You get everything that's in the Magenta except for you get an extra 20 gigabytes of 4G LTE, then it's down to G, uh, 3G. Uh, you get everything over here, same thing. 
uh, right here, you get 2G at two times the, uh, the data speeds up to 256 kilo, uh, kilobits. That's the same thing right there. Same thing right there. Uh, you get extra voice to text, name, I, I mean, caller ID. Uh, you get uh, HD streaming, which is free. Uh, voice to text, which is free. And call ID, which is free. Uh, and extra $10 a month. So that's the plans with uh, with T-Mobile. Now, am I happy with T-Mobile? Oh, hell yeah. Most definitely. I am I am ecstatic with T-Mobile, man. So I'm good with T-Mobile. And like I said before, it's, it's, it's up to you guys whether or not you want. It's personal preference. Whether or not you want to go with T-Mobile, AT&T, or, um, or um, Sprint. Here's AT&T. Now, I had AT&T before because, see, back in the day, back in the day, they, they had exclusives, phones, for, uh, that was exclusive to the carrier, right? Now, the problem with AT&T was I did not like the, the customer service. They did have good service. They, you know, they had a nice little map of the area where you can get service at. But at that time, I wasn't a truck driver and I wasn't going nowhere and all the service was in Cleveland. So basically all the service was good anyway. You know, I had fast 4G speed. I, I had no drops in the phones or nothing like that. But, um, but they customer service sucked. They, they customer service, mm -mm. excuse me, they customer service was awful. So right here, we got AT&T plans. You got the, you got the AT&T Unlimited Elite for $50 a month. Uh, here's what you get. You get unlimited talk, text, and, I mean, talk, text, and data in the U.S., Mexico, and Canada. After 100 gigabytes, AT&T may slow the data speeds when the network is busy. Roman may be at 2G speeds, so make sure you read the fine print. And you, right here, you get 100 gigabytes, so you figure you'll burn through that. You'll burn through that. You know what I'm saying? You get high-definition uh, streaming. Automatic fraud blocking and spam risk alerts, unlimited texts from the U.S. to 120 companies, uh, companies, countries, unlimited texts from, well, okay, I said that, 30, 30 gigs of mobile hotspot per line. Remember, you only get 30 gigs, and then it slows down to a maximum of 128 gigs. You get 5G access, 100 gigs of premium data which will slow down if the network is busy. You get HBO at no extra charge and a signature program that saves you up to $10 a month per line. The best value, AT&T Unlimited Extra for $40 a month. After 50 gigabytes, AT&T may temporarily slow data speeds if the network is busy. You get the same as you get over here. But you you lose out you lose out on the hundred on the hundred gigabytes of premium data. You don't get HBO and you don't get a signature program. But if this is a oh that's the elite okay unlimited extra and the lowest price ever AT and T unlimited starter for thirty five dollars a month. AT&T may slow your data speeds if the network is busy. Now, it doesn't say uh, how much after. It just said that it may slow it after, after, uh, after your network, you know, after you touch whatever you get. And here you get everything that's in the, in the first two, except you don't get the, the 5G access and you don't, get the, you don't get the premium data. So... This is uh, and this is if you only get one line. Oh, wait a minute, that's up to three lines. Okay, all right, so one line. My fault. I ain't gonna go through all this stuff again. I'll just give you the prices. So the elite is eighty five dollars a month. 
Uh, the uh, extra is seventy five dollars a month, and the starter is sixty five dollars a month. So that's uh, that's the prices for uh, AT and T. So if you want AT and T, like I said, it's it's personal preference. So AT and T and Verizon is the number one and the number two uh, two companies that has good service you know you you're able to probably get maybe a bar or two in certain situations but uh but yeah but they still they still drop calls too hey as i was saying i'm i'm not a fan i'm not a fan of sprint i am not a fan i i had sprint of course like i said they they had exclusivities to their phones at one time and sprint had what you called the palm pre at the time and i wanted that phone it was it was like a little slider phone that you could slide up and um and it was like it was like one of them communicators on star trek and i i wanted that so in order to get it i had to jump over to uh, Sprint. Now, did I did I leave Verizon when I made the jump over to AT and T, the jump over to T Mobile, the jump over to Sprint? No, I was still with <laughs> I was still with Verizon. I just wanted the phone. Now, let's talk about Sprint and see what they got to offer. Now, Sprint got three plans as well. Um, their unlimited basic is sixty dollars a month. I'm not sure if it's for one phone, though. Okay, wait. Yeah, this is for one phone. Two lines, three lines, three lines. Okay. Um, but uh, but wait, the unlimited basic is sixty dollars a month. But but don't let me don't let me chop down Sprint. Sprint is a good company if you're if you're in a city that you're not planning on leaving. If you're not a truck driver and you just want a phone, then Sprint might be that phone to get, all right? Don't get me wrong. Sprint might be that phone to get. I'm not a fan of it, all right? But here we go. Uh, it includes DVD quality video streaming, uh, 500 megabytes of LT, uh, LTE mobile hotspot. You also get Hulu. Let's see. The basic, you get Hulu, you get 500 megabytes of mobile hotspot, data, uh, DVD data streaming, unlimited talk text, and 5G of uh, 4G data while roaming in Canada and Mexico. Uh, let's see. Their next one is the Unlimited Plus, uh, which is $70, which includes the same thing as the unlimited basic but you get an S you get title and hulu all right sorry about that that was a quick phone call so let me go ahead and finish up this uh this uh this podcast for you right quick um what i was saying this uh unlimited plus 70 dollars a month includes everything that's in the basic but you get this title view plans detail you get uh, all your favorite music, music artists, exclusives, all on title. Uh, same thing with that. You get about 50 gigabytes of LTE, LTE Lite Mobile Hotspot HD streaming at a one. I mean at 1080 at 1080p and unlimited talk, text, and data. 10 gigabytes of 4G data while roaming. Okay. Okay. The next one is the unlimited premium, nearly $150 in value, perfect for 5G devices. This is $80 a month, includes everything that's in the plus. You will get Prime, don't know what that is, Hulu, and Tidal. We'll find out what that is. Oh, Lockout. Hey, that should be me, Lockout Man. Um... I think this is I think this is their oh that's their uh premium protection uh protection for their for their phones. Okay. So yeah, so those are the four carriers. Uh hopefully 
hopefully one of these will be right for you. Um, you know, it's, it's like I said before, it's all about personal preference. It's, it's about, it's about, um, it's about what you like. You know what I'm saying? If you, if you like, uh, if, if you like AT&T, T-Mobile, Verizon, or, or, or Sprint, then go ahead and jump on it. Not neither one of these, neither one of these carriers are the best carriers. Do they have their ups and downs? Yes. Do they have their flaws? Yes. Do they drop out? Yes. But it's just a matter of which one that you want. Now, if you're a content creator like myself and and you feel that data is the most important thing, which which should be a most important thing for all truck drivers, because everything is done by apps now. Uh, if you working for a trucking company that that has uh, that has app base um, that has some apps for their company, then you're going to be, you know, communicating through them to them through the app. You know what I'm saying? You use apps for Uber. You use apps for Lyft. If you're owner operator, Uber Freight, uh, DAT has an app for their freight. So you're going to be using a lot of data. So they, if, if data is going to be important to you, then that's what you need to concentrate on. Am I going to waste money getting the S20? I doubt it. I doubt it. Well, if you guys like content like this and more, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, and hit that bell for more content like this. And don't forget to hit that all button. You know what I'm saying? That all button. So I appreciate you guys joining me. I appreciate you guys watching. And stay tuned for the next uh, next podcast that I might do. Might be with a different banner, I guess. But uh, until then, you guys take it easy. I hope you guys have a blessed day. Stay safe out there. My name's Lockout Men, and I will come back at you with another video podcast. Peace.